The eight hour plus work day has been the norm in Western culture for more than a century. But as the pandemic shuffled our habits and traditions, some researchers are asking whether workers would be more productive and companies more profitable with shorter mm. shifts. A new article in Wired UK asks whether a five hour work day could be ideal. Wired UK contributor Margaret Taylor joins us now. She wrote that piece. So, Margaret, we've all heard about companies trying the four day work week, yeah. a shorter week. What's the argument for a shorter work day? Yeah, so there's quite a lot of research around shorter working days. There's been a lot done in Sweden on that a few years back. Um, there, there were various different experiments looking at the six hour working days there. Um, and the findings of that were that people were happier, they, they were spending more time with their families, um, and as employee well being went up, their, their productivity went up as well. Um, yeah, that, that, that's been backed up by research from Oxford University, but, but there's been other research done. Now, this is published in a book by the, the consultant Alex Pang. He, he's reviewed a lot of the research, which says that cognitively, actually, for, uh, concentration-wise, people work better. In, in fact, well, they don't work better, but a, a five-hour burst of activity um, is when you'll get the, the best out of employees. Huh. And now we know the pandemic has accelerated some workplace trends, obviously, of course, remote work. But how do you think it's changed how companies think about scheduling and productivity when you talk about these five hour days? You know, obviously, people have had a lot going on at home with their kids there and all that type of stuff. What kind of stuff exactly. do you think will change, you know? Yeah, well, now, there have been companies that, that have been doing this, and as a result of the pandemic, um, they've kind of had to abandon the five-hour working day. There was a company in Germany that was doing it, and it, it was having good results. Uh, but people were very productive, but then when everyone went to working from home, it just wasn't going to work, because mm. the, the whole point of the five-hour working day is that you are, you're, you're sitting down and you're focusing. It's 8 a.m. to 1 p.m., no breaks, no cell phones. You're, you're just sitting there, and you're, you're really focusing on the work. So the, the pandemic the pandemic has really changed that because with people working from home, obviously they can't do that. There are so many distractions. Um, so so there's had to be a bit of a rethink. But in terms of getting people back to the office, it could be something that, that employers start thinking about. Yeah. Because th th there's a lot of chat about hybrid working. People wanted to spend some time at home, spend some time in the office. And actually, th there's a company in Liverpool in England has found that the best way of making it work is to have perhaps a couple of short days and a couple of normal days. So people, if they're working at home, they could have their longer days at home and the short days in the office. Mm, interesting stuff. Yeah. All right. Well, see, Margaret, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.